just the, the fall off of Virginia basketball from that stretch from 2014 to 2019. They were the one seed four of those six years, including a national championship. One of those, they were the two seed and the five seed in the other two of those six years. Since then, they haven't won a tournament game and they have not been a top three seed. And quite frankly, last year was pretty embarrassing, especially the way they went out in the first four to Colorado state. They failed to reach 50 points in several games. It's, it's gone whatever you want to attribute it to NIL portal, whatever Virginia basketball has not nearly been what it, what it used to be very, very recently. And honestly, I was very grim on them bouncing back this off season until like two days ago. when after they lost out on top 50 point guard recruit, Trent Perry, all of a sudden their off season has gone from zero to 100. They added a, uh, three transfers, soon to be four, just a lot of versatility and athleticism added to the roster, including Duke transfer TJ Power, who was a five-star recruit last year. So they are set up to be better than last year, but Tony Bennett's not a guy that's going to be coaching as long as Jim Laranega or Leonard Hamilton is. I think that's a very, very agreed upon fact. So I think he to to in, increase his shelf life in the game to prove that he still has a place at being an elite coach in college basketball. Tony Bennett needs a needs a great season in, in 2024, 20, 